Hi friends, welcome to my home kitchen. Hope you all having a good time. Today I am going to show you mutton biryani. The following ingredients are required for this recipe. 2 cups basmati rice. I have already washed and soaked it for 30 minutes. 500 grams of mutton or baby goat meat. I have marinated it with some cod, salt and oil. I have marinated it for 1 hour. 2 onion chopped into thin slices. 3 teaspoon of ginger garlic paste, 2 teaspoon of red chili paste, 4 teaspoon of clarified butter, 4 teaspoon of olive oil, biryani masala or biryani powder, fried onion, half cup cod, 1 tomato, chopped mint leaf, coriander leaf, sugar, saffron, 4 teaspoon of milk required for dissolving saffron, cashew nut, turmeric powder, red chili powder. Apart from that I need the following spices, nutmeg, star anise, bay leaves, cloves, green cardamom, cumin seeds, orange food color, Let's start our cooking. Now I will switch on the stove. Here I am using a heavy button pan. Now my pan has become hot. I will add clarified butter. And olive oil. In place of olive oil, you can use any type of vegetable oil or you can only cook it with clarified butter also. Now oil is hot, I will add cloves, cumin seeds, cinnamon stick, green cardamom, baby. Then I will add chopped onion. Fry it for 5 minutes, then I will add ginger garlic paste. Now onion is become translucent, I will add ginger garlic paste. Then I will cook it for 5 minutes. Now I will add tomato. Turmeric powder, red chili powder, then I will cover the lid and I will cook it for 5 minutes. Then okay, now marinated mutton goes into it. Now we'll add cod. Red chili paste. One teaspoon of biryani masala. In a masser, I have masked nutmeg and star in it. So here I am adding 1 teaspoon of nutmeg and star in this powder. Now I am adding little bit of water.
to now cover the lid. In between this, I'll prepare rice. So here in another pan, I'll boil some water. Then in this water, I'll add salt. Karam cloth. Then I'll cover the lid. Water is boiling. Now rice goes into it. So here already I have added salt, cloves and green cardamom. Remember one important point, you need to soak the rice for half an hour. You will cook it till it is half done. I will check the mutton. Now I am adding 1 teaspoon of sugar. Now rice is half done, I will strain it and I will layer for the biryani. onion little bit of orange color chopped coriander leaves mint leaf cashew nut Again, I'll put another layer. Again, I'll put some fried onion, cashew nut, chopped coriander leaves, mint leaf. and saffron so my biryani layering is done I have put the biryani pan above a tawa or you can use any flat heavy metal griddle so now I will cook it for 20 minutes now we are almost done I will put some desi ghee or clarified butter above it. Now I will switch up our stove. Now I will plate my dish biryani is ready now you can serve it with onion and cucumber raita or with plain cod hope you like my video keep watching this space for many more recipes thank you friends bye for now and have a good day ahead.